hello, welcome, welcome back to my channel. I, yeah, okay. So this is originally a video I wanted to have done in March, um, but I, I got poorly, so I didn't end up reading all of these books. Uh, I started the first one, but that's about as far as I went. Anyway, so let's start. So the first book, Roundbreaker. <laughs> I had to check that I picked up the right one. Roundbreaker. I first read this in like 2021, 21-ish, and I liked it fine, but I also felt like there were too many characters to keep track of, and I didn't really do that as you're supposed to be doing when there's multiple POVs going back and forth. So, yeah. First time I read that. Then, last year, I think about April time, I picked up the second book, Blade Breaker, which, at the time, I felt like it had been too big of a gap since I'd read the first one. So, I didn't feel like I got what the second book was trying to give at least that's why at least that's what i was trying to tell myself third book third book third book fate breaker came out this year came out end of feb early march anyway it came out a couple of weeks ago um and I knew this, so my thought was that I would reread book one and book two, you know, right after the other one, and then read book three. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. So, <laughs> I'll say this before I get into, like, what the books are about, but I've, I've ended up reading all of them, uh, like, from 21 and last year, I've read all of them now three times. Yes, so I read uh, Round Breaker twice in this month. I read Blade Breaker twice in this month. I read Fate Breaker three times this month. Yes, yes I did. <laughs> and here's why. So before I get into the why part, well maybe I should just do the why part. No, I'll do the right part. So. <sighs> I desperately want to really like these books. I mean, it's it's an epic adventure sort of a deal, and there's dragons. So, I mean, it feels like I should, and it's not it's not hard to read. You you know what's happening when it's happening, and I mean, I do. If I take a big of too big of a break from them. I ended up wondering who was who, and I mean just from picking up the, like, this, the sequel after the prequel, there's no prequel, <laughs> when I picked them up right after the other one, uh, I still kind of felt confused. So there's this character called Andre, and I kept wanting to think this person was a girl, it's a dude. Also, I kept thinking they were called Andy. There's an R in there. <laughs> and no why. <laughs> so, I, I don't know why I was reading it as Andy and not Andre. With an I-E and not a Y. Um, I don't know. Um, <laughs> that's just, just just one of the ones that <laughs> I kept... I kept being confused about this character and there's not really a reason for me to have been confused about this character. So while I was reading the books, I was fully immersed, I feel. But then as soon as I put them down, I did not know what I had just read. It was like my mind did not want to suck up the story as a way. It didn't want to soak it up and stay there. <laughs> so what I remember from these, and I mean I just finished, finished them, <sighs> I remember very little and I don't like that. I don't like that I don't remember more than a very, 
very few pieces and I mean I'm, my memory is not that bad but for some reason it doesn't want to stick in my brain I don't know why I, I honestly don't know why because I've been reading other books and they stick just fine but these it's like I haven't even read them and I've read them three times in a very short amount of time. I've read the third one three times in a very short amount of time. So what is wrong? Is it me? Is it the books? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, maybe in the future, like far off in the future, I'll pick them up again and see. And I'll have to like try to remember to reference this video and what the hell is going on. But there we go. So, <laughs> what are the books about? Well... <laughs> Good question, good question. So, it's basically, we have multiple POVs. Some of the POVs are um, in the same group, and some of them are other groups, and people, characters in the same group, but different characters. Anyway, there's so, so many characters, so many things happening. So we have, like, the main group, which are the good guys say and they are set off well they're setting off to like close these spindles because um, one of the characters she is like of spindle born or well her her dad was spindle born confusion anyway um basically she has the ability to close these spindles um, and we want them closed because the spindles go to other worlds and we don't want the worlds mixing, okay? We don't want that because demons and such. And at one point we have, because of the spindles, we have like an undead army and the undead are like uh, people that's been in our world that's just walking around and uh, yeah, yeah. Imagine seeing someone, seeing a loved one that you know died and seeing them walking around being an army dude for the enemy. Basically, it's it's very... It's very Lord of the Rings. It's very Tolkien in that way because we have this long adventure mission. Basically, they do a lot of walking around and that's also a thing because they do a lot of walking around but... It, it wasn't completely clear if they had, like, where they were going. Because it feels like they just went back and forth to the same places. They didn't really, but it, that's what it felt like. They, they just went back and forth to the same places and didn't really go anywhere. Like, whereas in Lord of the Rings, you know there's a lot of walking around, but you do get to some places and you kind of, even though you don't, actually no you can reference reference the maps but you don't uh, you don't really keep track of like if they're going in a big circle or if they're like going forwards but it feels like they are because they keep going somewhere whereas in these books it doesn't feel like they're going anywhere so there's that there's also a point where some people break up from the main group you know, like Pippin and Mary does and Frodo and um, Samwise goes off and then there's, I, I mean, I was gonna say all that's missing is a wizard, but is it though? <laughs> is it? I'm actually a bit sad because I wanted them to be more and maybe they can be, but in this particular time in my life, apparently these books are not giving me enough. Two of them do have stunning sprayed edges though, and I could have sworn the first one did too, but apparently not. Um, <laughs> so, you know, there's that. There's that. I wasn't bored while reading them, I must say that. I wasn't bored, I was entertained all the way. It's just that it didn't want to stick. So it feels like I haven't read them, which I have. I'm quite positive I've read these books, but we can't love all the books. We can't get all the books, like in understanding, kind of getting. Yeah, it is what it is, but it's fine. It happens. It happens. 
<laughs> Let me know if you've read any of these books and what your thoughts on them are because I feel like I'm missing something but I'm, I, I can't quite put my finger on it and maybe someone else can help me out. I'm also just looking at this because I feel like uh, this last book has a broken spine but <laughs> like literally it's the glue is coming off from the wood anyway um yeah let me know and we'll see if you don't want to comment you can send me a message on instagram probably i'm a bit everywhere and nowhere at all so you know find me somewhere there are links i think pretty sure yeah anyway thanks so much for watching i shall see you all next time until then take care bye bye